I think people who know me, if you ask them, what is Gaylor's legacy, whatever that means, <laughs> they'd probably say his interest in leadership. A person sitting in the boat with you will never bore holes in the boat. And so if I want you not to bore holes in my organizational boat, I have to make sure you're in the boat with me. And so as a leader, I think the key is to get them involved in the process. People support those things they help create. Listen to their ideas, promote their involvement, ask them uh, uh, how they feel about certain things. Involving a person in the decision process allows them to feel a certain ownership. I really think that when somebody pops into the world initially at birth, that it's like we each get pinged by some magic touch and we're given talents that it's up to us to develop. I became a student of leadership. It just fascinated me. You gotta be honest, it may not be the answer they wanna hear, but if I, if I lie to the airmen, they're gonna find out I lied to them and they're not gonna trust me. And so I thought, as much as it hurts, I'm gonna have to try to be honest. I'm 83 years old now. The Air Force is part of me. I bleed Air Force blue. And I think it's important to share my stories and my thoughts and my experiences so that you know, it can make you think, well, I wonder what doors are out there for me.